Hey guys, breaking news here on the EJC show, aka EJC Exploration. Uh, Alex Pereira returns on October the 5th, uh, UFC 307 in Utah. He's fighting a, a round tree? <laughs> He's fighting a tree or some sort of plant, I think, or, or something. <laughs> what is it? Round tree? I think that's it. That's his like, uh, that's his like name. His name is Roundtree. His, not his actual name, I don't think. I think that's his actual that's name. That's his name? Yeah, Roundtree. Um, it's, light heavyweight, yeah. you know, so. Fighting for the belt. For the belt, defending it again. Uh, uh, just coming off the victory versus Yuri. Yep. Um, I don't know anything about Roundtree. Um, black man? Black man? Black strong man. <laughs> so. Yo, pass. Probably built like a tree. Yeah, he, he's good. Is it, is it good? I need, we're going to have to I do mean, some research. He's got to be good to fight Alex Pereira. To, well, to fight for the title, he's got to yeah, be good. Yeah, exactly. Know? So that's probably our ignorance there, but um, we'll do a little bit more research about him so we can like you know actually know something about him when it when that time comes around. More. I've seen him multiple times like knocking people out and stuff. Okay, okay. But, yeah, uh, Dana just announced that. Um is Aljamain Sterling on that same card as well? Yeah, he is. He okay. he's uh early early main card. All right, cool. But yeah, so they're and going. And then they going. got Kevin Holland fighting again, which I don't understand the hype about Kevin Holland. Like I, he he's on the main cards, but I don't see why he he, he doesn't he, bring it. He stepped up and fought uh, uh, Chamaya, did he not? I believe he took. Not he, sure. It, there was remember when Chamaya came in way overweight. And they had to switch an opponent. I believe either he switch either, yeah, because yeah, it was supposed to be Chamaya versus Nate Diaz, and Chamaya came in way overweight. So Holland fought Chamaya instead, lost, and then Diaz fought Ferguson for his last fight, and won. Um, which Tony Ferguson fought recently too. But he's I hope hopefully he retires. But so I guess Roundtree is up now uh, to to go for the belt in the lightweight division, light heavyweight division, um, which is two hundred five in uh, MMA so we'll be interested to be see. exciting yeah hopefully hopefully he brings it to Alex Pereira because as you as you saw recently he's just been wiping him out yeah first he's walking round, through these second guys. round you know he's yeah. just and Jerry's no no slouch no Jerry is amazing fighter yeah. I mean I mean you saw their last fight it was close like yeah. he hit him you know Alex hit him Multiple times. He hit Alex multiple times. I keep thinking, when I think about that fight, I think about that clip where Alex looks at him and he, like, gives him, he, like, body gives yeah, out. Yeah, bro. It was, I think going into it, Yuri had a, the wrong mindset, really. Yeah. Because he was kind of already. He was so worried about the magic and all that stuff. That yeah. Kinda, like, it was fight, you know. It was messing with him a bunch. I so. think so, yeah. Uh, but anyways, yeah. Hopefully a round tree <laughs> can just stand there <laughs> plant himself into the ground and and not fall yeah and do do let's a good hope job. round tree doesn't go timber that's what we need to hope for <laughs> um but yeah we'll see i'm gonna do a little, we're gonna do some more research and we'll have more as that fight gets closer more, more yeah information. Absolutely. absolutely we're just coming in to let y'all know yeah breaking news we just heard it from dana so we wanted to get it to you first like this video um, comment what you guys think about it and, and subscribe uh, and, and things about Roundtree as well so you can let us know a little bit more about him yeah yeah, yeah on the comments peace guys alrighty